morning. Wake up. Morning, morning, morning. Well, I know morning is M-O-U-R-N-I-N-G. Okay. Morning. Okay. Well, you say, well, morning, M-O-R-N-I-N-G. Well, aren't those different words? And why are you saying that if I say that I'm saying one when I know I'm not? Well, it's not about the, the spelling of the word family. It's about the tone of the word. Don't you understand that vibration is about tones and frequencies, not the spelling of a word? Don't you know that? So morning and morning is the same word because it's the same tone. If you have to read the word to see how it's spelled, you have been deceived. It's the same tone, family. So when you wake up and you tell someone, good morning, you're telling them, cry, be sorrowful, and be good at it. Because, hey, you did awake, right? And what is awake? It is a, 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 a funeral, okay? It is, it is the viewing of a dead body. That's what awake is. And so every day we awake to say good morning. And then we go to a job. Wait a second, job. Job, J-O-B. What else does that spell? Job. But Job, job, same three letters, but different pronunciations. But who is Job? Job is a person that loved God. And no matter how much he loved God, everything he had was stripped from him. Wait a second, time out. What's a job? Now, Job put all his energy into God, and yet at the end was still stripped off of a bet with Satan. Wait a second. What's a job? A job is something that you go to every single day and pour your life into, your love into, your energy into, and yet it does not give you back what you truly have earned. It's a job. You will be stripped of your destiny because while you go and work for this job or this job, you're not working for you. You're working for them, manifesting their reality for them. And so when it comes time for you to have something, you will realize you don't have it. That the only thing that you worked to build, truly build, was that company that you worked for. And you will say, okay, I gave all of my energy to that company. And of course I did. And I knew I was. Because when I clocked out, I literally said I was off. Wow. Just like if I'm energy and they need me to only give them my energy, because if you begin to give you your energy, you may be a millionaire and never need to come back and work for them. So they're going to create these words to tell you that you're off now. You're no longer energy. You're no longer light. You're no longer magic. So whenever you get off, just go home and enjoy yourself. Just do things that 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 give you instant gratification but don't work for you don't clock in for you you understand and so you're going to this job every single day sacrificing your own dream the abilities you have you are sacrificing and you're going and using a skill set they taught you to get a job done for them and then at the end of the week w e a k when you are weakened at the end of five days, you are weekend, weekend. This is when they give you your earnings, earn, earnings. Awake is a funeral. Morning is when you cry over a lost one. A earn is what you put the ashes of a lost one in at awake. Wait a second, time out. Earnings, you are in, I-N-G, earnings. Why do they call it earnings? I'm burning up my energy for them. And they're gonna give me back the urn. But the urn is incomplete because they have taken so much off the top family. It's literally ashes by the time they give it to you. So every week you work for five days until you're weakened, until they give you your earnings, which are taxed, and then you come back the next week to do it again. With the earnings, you buy your food. But Neo, you are a hunter. With the earnings, you buy your home. But Neo, you are a builder. Imagine a squirrel paying someone for nuts. Imagine a squirrel going and getting on a hamster's wheel to earn paper money 
to pay for a hole in a tree. See, it's only then when you realize that Neo, you are truly in the matrix playing a huge role in the matrix. You are every person around you that you're trying to free because you are stuck in the same loop that they're stuck in doing the same things. And even though you are aware that something is wrong, you're still doing it because you don't know how to change it. Well, Neo, you got to wake up. And what waking up looks like is doing the work. Don't you dare say you want to be something and not be willing to do the work because it's not easy being accountable to being Neo. It's not easy being the one that has to unlearn all of the crap you were taught. It's not easy being the one to wake people up because people will hate you for it, not love you for it. It's not easy being Neo. It's not easy not having friends because they, they don't see eye to eye with you anymore. But you are a master manipulator, a master manifester. Now, a lot of you might say, well, Kevin, if I'm a master manifester, why don't I have everything that I want? What if I told you that you do? Everything that you have right now is exactly what you want. Because that's what you've been earning. That's what you've been putting in to get it. Wanting is not desire. So if you would desire to be in a different place, you might think that's wanting, but that is not. That's simply the thing that you do to make yourself feel bad about yourself or even feel better. What you want is what you're doing. So if you say, hey, I want to be a master manifester. You've always been manifesting. You just had need to control how you manifest. It's like somebody saying, well, you have to know how to breathe correctly. And you say, well, I wish I could breathe correctly. Well, you've always been breathing, but controlling your breathing is a different story. So you actually do know how to breathe. Like you actually do know how to manifest your reality. You're doing it. If you weren't, you wouldn't be here. If you weren't breathing, you'd be dead. So of course you still say, I don't know how to breathe. But what you're saying is, the what I, I don't know how to breathe to get what I want. Somehow I'm ending up with things I don't want. But what I'm trying to tell you is, no, you're not. You're still ending up with everything that you want. What you're trying to say is, I want to learn how to manifest to get positive things. Now, what that means is I have to regulate my mind to get in control of my manifesting. Because if I'm if I'm flying by the seat of my pants and I'm in whatever mood at any time and I'm letting the matrix control me via what I see or anything, I am not going to be in control of what I manifest. Do you understand, family? So regulating your energy, bringing yourself back into oneness with your purpose is how you can be, a, be, be, be become a a master manifester and start manifesting the things that you actually do want. You need to understand the concepts. So here we go. If you want something, family, you must be doing something to achieve it. And if you are not, you do not want that thing. Please understand that. Do you understand that? Where I am is exactly where I want to be because the work that I put in got me here. If you say I want to be a millionaire, but you don't want to do the work, you are disrespectful to the universe and you are a liar. Any person who does not want to do the work to be where they want to be, you are blatantly disrespectful and a habitual liar and you are full of sin and you will never have what you want, family. Neo cannot be a liar. Neo has to be true to himself and everyone around him and you have to be accountable to that. This means when someone asks you if you're great, you say yes, even though they will tell you you're arrogant. Do you understand? When someone asks you, do you have what it takes to, 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 to succeed in life? You are supposed to say, absolutely. I am what it takes to succeed in life. I don't care if they find you arrogant. You have to be honest with everyone, even if they don't believe you. So today, family, please understand that in order to truly manifest what you want in life, you have to be honest and stay honest. Now they try to trick you with that word. You understand? Because think about it. Look at it. H-O-N-E-S-T. On. Honest. They don't, even, they don't even pronounce the H. Honest. 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 You have to be, huh? This is how they get you, yo. You have to be, huh? Honest. 
honest. You have to be honest. You have to stop lying. They spell lying correctly, but they ain't spell honest right, right? You have to be honest. Not the word. Be it. Never lie. Always tell the truth. At least never lie. You have to want to do the work. If you don't see the process and love the process, you are not going to have what you want. Please understand me, Neo. If you want to free the world and you're not willing to do the work, you're not going to get what you want, Neo. Neo, bullets stop when you put your hand out. You will fly, Neo, when you choose to. But you have to look to the sky. See, when Neo began to fly, notice the first thing he did was look at the sky. You, might, you manifest to you what you focus on. Many of you guys, when you wake up, why do you immediately focus on the negativity? Why do you immediately focus on the people who don't believe in you? Why do you immediately focus on the people who, who don't see you going far? Why, why do you immediately see the negative comments? Start responding only to the good. What you focus on grows. So start responding only to the good, Neo. You understand? And back to my point. Love the process of being who you need to be.